Okay, welcome to Assassin Avion. That's me, Assassin's Creed 2 playthrough. And, uh, you just delivered that letter to that guy, whoever the hell out uh, don't fall over. Oh, codex page. Okay, that'll work. That, that helps. Or, no, that was a feather. Uh, I don't know what that was. But, oh, codex page. Okay, yeah, I understand. And, um, so you just told that old fat ass guy that you kill that. Sorry, spoilers. <laughs> don't ki you don't kill him, you just assassinate him. Same thing, pretty much, actually. Not really. <laughs> Sorry. Um, and. And then after you kill him, or. I mean, no. He. He betrays you. Gets your daddy O and your brother O's killed. I mean, I don't know why the autistic son of a bitch was allowed to live, because I'm pretty sure that at this time period. Um. They would have just been killed. Well, if they were... I know that they would have been killed if they were freaking German... Ger German, what the hell is that? And German, like, freaking Vikings. Because... When children were born, they were left out in... They were left outside for, like, a week or something. And... They were not allowed to be touched by anyone. And they would be... And so if they were able to survive... Then they would be accepted into the clan. If they didn't, then they would just be thrown out, pretty much. Um, that's a way to root out the weak. It's like what the Spartans did, except uh, it involves killing the babies instead of having the babies kill people. Cause that's what Spartans did. They had their and like 13 year old kids kill slaves. What, mom? What'd I do? Oh. Okay. <laughs> a few days ago, uh. I, my parents got me a toothbrush. Because I lost mine, because I'm smart. And I haven't unpacked them yet. Heh <laughs> And so now you're like so now you witness your Pandre e Brotheros getting their hanged because they're retarded by that fat ass. He's, that is a naked statue of a guy. There's a Spaniard. He's a Templar. Bastard. Look at your little brother. <laughs> like he was like, Oh god, no! And then he's like, What's going on here? And now he's asleep. Uh. And he dies. Ha ha ha. Now you kick the two guards' asses, and there's a brute. And brutes are very hard to kill. And so he smacks that out of your hand. And... That's a, that's a guy on your side. And now you get attacked by like 20 trillion people. And so he just runs away, unless you're retarded and think you can fight them hand to hand. Or not hand to hand, hand to sword. And hand to metal. Uh, yeah. Because a lot of them probably have armor on, and you have a hand. So your hand's gonna get broken pretty easily. So I'll just run away from them because they're retarded and slow. And now I'm safe. And...
memory sequence one complete. And now I'm notorious and guards are on high alerts. And there's a mission in this game where like you bring down your notoriety. And you can't bring down your notoriety until you do that mission. Which is annoying. But whatever. So now I think this is the same year? Yeah it is. Yeah, those are posters or whatever that have your, uh, whatever. And here's your sister or girlfriend, I'm not exactly sure. Did not mean to do that. Sorry. Oh, that's your girlfriend. Okay. And so your sister or girlfriend tells you to go to the well, phone. What's over here? A beat up event? I'll do it. No problem. Kick your husband's ass any day. If I get to smack yours. Sorry. It, it just slipped out. I'm sorry. I suppose I'm like Moroku. Our <laughs> certain parts of our body are just cursed to that sort of ideas. And if you don't know who Moroku is, then get a TV. Well, actually, not anymore. Go back in time to 2003 and get a TV. Or probably maybe about that. Um, about that time. So that's a cheating husband that they got to be cra beat the crap out of. Just kick his ass. <laughs> his head's inside the wall. That was easy. Ready, you fat horn. Come on my way. I want to see your ass again. Okay, so which general direction am I going in? I'm going in that way. I'm going in that way. Oh, wait. Maybe that... I don't know. Never mind. Let me jump, you fat fucker. Sorry, I, I say that a lot, don't I? <laughs> so now you got to make your way to your girlfriend's sister's whorehouse. Man, your girlfriend's sister is, like, super hot, and she hits on you. Because she, since she's the owner of a brothel, she probably is, she probably is or was a worker at a brothel. And if you don't know what a brothel is, um, it's a whorehouse. Which I probably said six times. So, get some ears. Okay. The diner. For her birthday dinner? Wow. Um, okay. Uh, sorry about that. My mom walked in and told me that for my birthdays, or for my sister's birthday dinner, she wants to go to a diner instead of like somewhere where we usually go for birthdays, like uh, a this Irish restaurant that's around here, or Outback Steakhouse, or whatever. Um, so we're going to go to a diner that we go to often, but whatever. Yeah, now that uh, you're notorious, guards are going to notice you easier, so if you're just like walking around, they'll probably like attack you. Maybe, I don't know. 
So just hide in haystacks and shit. That's my friend Tommy. Brofster972. His name is pretty bad, but whatever. His choice. I think I might just kill him just because he's annoying me, because he's noticing me. I don't like being. Oh, fudge. Okay, that works. Uh, yeah, I'm running out of time. I'll get that thing later, so. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, stay tuned for more videos. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe.